comment nous devrions nous commencer une introduction. Is that, is that French? Can we get a translator? The king's English. No need for translation, sir. I can speak it well enough. Good. My name is Dr. Raymond Ham, and I... Ah, a doctor. A like-minded individual, no doubt. Wherein is your speciality, sir? Cryptobiology. Why? <laughs> a medical man such as myself wanders abound, and here I worried I had been abducted by common street thugs. This place, then, this is your laboratory. I had wondered, as clean as it is, and with such little trace of the pestilence here. The pestilence? What do you mean? The scourge. The great dying. Come now, you know, the... Mm, what is it they call it? The... The... Ah, no matter. The pestilence, yes. It abounds outside these walls, you know. So many have succumbed. And many more will continue to, until such time as a perfect cure can be developed. Fortunately, I am very close. It is my duty in life to rid the world of it, you see. The cure to end all cures. When you say the great dying, are you talking about the bubonic plague? I don't know what that is. Well, I see. Right, well... The entities our agents encountered at the house, uh, they were dead when you encountered them. Yes, you reanimated them. Hmm. In a manner of speaking, you see things too simply, Doctor. Expand your horizons. Life and death. Sickness and health. These are amateur terms for amateur physicians. There is only one ailment that exists in the world of men, and that is the pestilence, and nothing else. Make no mistake, they were very ill. All of them. But you think you cured those people? Indeed. My cure is most effective. But the things we recovered were not human. Yes, well, it is not a perfect cure, but that will come with time, and further experimentation. I have spent a lifetime... Developing my methods, Dr. Ham, and will spend a lifetime more, if necessary. Now, we have wasted too much time. There is work to do. I will require a laboratory of my own, one where I can continue my research unimpeded. And assistance, of course, though I can provide those on my own. In time. <laughs> I don't think our organization would be willing to... Nonsense. We are all men of science. Fetch your coat and show me to my quarters, Doctor. Our work begins now. <laughs>